guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I did this Valentine's Day inspired makeup look for you. Last year I did one that's a little bit more pink, so if you want to see that, I'm going to leave the link down below. But today I wanted to incorporate red instead of pink because I love red way more than I like the pink, especially for Valentine's Day. I love a good old bold red lip. And I know it's hard to wear a red lip and it can be intimidating, especially for Valentine's Day because you're afraid like it's going to come off and you might want to be smooching and you don't want it to like smear everywhere. But this lip cream by Milani is amazing. Just watch. There's nothing. It will not come off. It will not flake off. It is amazing. So here you go. If you want to do a red lip, this is the one you have to go for for sure. If you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Leave some comments down below. If you haven't subscribed, make sure you do so before you leave and go watch all my other videos. And if you want to learn how to get this look, just keep on watching and let's get it started. It doesn't budge, so I'm going to use the Urban Decay Primer Potion in Eden to prime my eyes. And I'm going to take this matte brown from the Makeup Revolution palette. And it comes with 12 shades, very inexpensive. It only comes with two matte shades and the rest are shimmers. Um, so I don't know how I like that, but the mattes were nice. Now I'm going to use that glitter that shimmery shade and as you can tell I sprayed my brush and it's still not showing up on my eyelid so I was a little disappointed and I decided to go on with this more intense gold to see if that would make a difference and use my finger instead of a brush but it was not doing me any justice so they're not my favorite so after that I decided I was going to apply some gold glitter from Mika Beauty Cosmetics and I'm first applying some glitter glue by e.l.f. and now you can see the difference of that glitter and the other shimmery shades from the palette. I didn't want it to be too intense so I am slowly diffusing it with my fingers and I'm just applying some Wispies by Ardell. I'm going to spray my face before applying the Too Faced Born This Way foundation. I just feel like if I, apply, if I spray my face with some setting spray or any type of spray, it helps the foundation sink into my skin and it makes it look more natural and more flawless and it helps it not be cakey. Now I'm going to conceal with a Tarte Shape Cake Concealer and I'm just applying that under my eyes, my nose, my forehead, my chin, and around my nose, you already know. I'm going to blend that out with my beauty sponge. This is the Real Techniques beauty sponge and make sure it's damp, not dry. And it looks like I'm dragging, but I am dabbing. Don't drag, dab. Now I'm going to set it with the Wet n Wild Contour and Highlight um, Powder, the highlight powder obviously. And that is in Dulce de Leche. And I'm taking the NYX Contour and Highlight Palette and I'm taking that Cool Tone Brown. And I'm just contouring slash bronzing with that same shade, so I'm using a little bit of a fluffier brush um, instead of a more precise contour brush. Now I'm going to highlight my face with the Mary Luminizer by The Balm, and I think this is perfect for Valentine's because it's subtle, yet very beautiful, and kind of like you're going from within, but still like that pop of highlight. And I'm applying that on my cheekbones, on my cupid's bow, um, down my nose, the center of my nose, and just a little bit under my eyebrows. For blush, I'm going to be taking this BH Cosmetics um, blush palette, and I'm applying a little bit of that pink blush. I don't like to use a lot because the red washes you out, so I go back in with another shade after. Now, just like that, bam, my brows are done. I wish it was that easy. Now for lips, I'm using a NYX Lip Liner in Hot Red and a Milani Lip Cream in Devolution or something like that. I'll leave everything down below. But this is the perfect lip cream, the perfect red lip cream. It smells so good and it dries instantly and does not budge. It is perfect for Valentine's Day or any other special occasion. After I'm done with the lips, I'm going to go in with a little bit more of a red toned blush. And then I'm going to smoke out my bottom lash line just a tiny bit with that same matte brown so we're not so plain down there. And once I'm done with that, I'm also going to apply some mascara on my lower lashes. And I'm going to highlight my inner corners with the matte cream that they have, or cream shade that they have. And that is a completed look. I hope you guys have a wonderful Valentine's Day. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!